Born in Warsaw, he settled in London in 1935, after achieving instant recognition for his depiction of English life. Though his vigorous, idiosyncratic style has made him something of an outsider, not part of any school, he was both an official war artist and one of those chosen to draw the coronation. His globetrotting to every battlefront scene and his compulsion to record each occasion and its faces with the explosive energy of his pen and brush have made him an international figure. Two years ago, beneath these same arches, he began his most ambitious project, a gigantic labyrinthine autobiography in pictures which show him to have been an uncanny witness of every major world event, from George V's Jubilee and Gandhi's India to the Nuremberg Trials. Experiences and, but not a potted history. What I'm doing now, this memoir, is a sort of summing up. It's it's a magnum opus, as it were, of my of my life. I imagine, uh, but I've been through years painting a lot using the drawings, but never painting from a single drawing. Never what many artists do, simply enlarging a drawing into a painting, but always accumulating the material of great many drawings and squeezing out the essence. Amongst his patrons and subjects, he numbers Bernard Shaw, the royal family for a large mural in Buckingham Palace, Evelyn Waugh and Winston Churchill. His copious drawings of Paris in the 30s, from Streetwalkers to Sacha Guitry, have just been published in book form. Recently, with painting this memoir, with producing this synthesis, as it were, of my life, I have to look back, and I am possibly not willingly, but it tempts me to have shots at various elements of the past. And Paris was one of those elements. I felt that I have to look again at Paris. His desire to return to Paris a half century later, to recapture and compare, was prompted by the return of these drawings, which had been lost for 25 years. Paris in the 30s was mostly distinguished that it was tremendously French, tremendously Parisian, that we, visitors, foreigners, we are sinking into 